All right, let's see how Donnie's been doing on the old uh, cabinet. Hey! What are you doing? What's happening? Oh, I'm just sitting here, just enjoying the, the, the local newspaper, weekly newspaper, Lincoln County News, the best one in town. Sitting in my favorite chair next to a nice yes. stove. I don't know how you're still awake. Uh, well, I do doze a lot. Uh, so. That thing's throwing off some nice heat. Yeah. yeah. It does a pretty good job. It's a, it's a wood heater. I mean, I mean, it burns a lot of wood. Yeah. But what the heck? I like cutting firewood. And... Uh, so it works out good. And you can cook right in it. Yeah, yeah. That's hey, an old timer. I got I got my camping gear all ready to go either up north or ice fishing. <laughs> You're ready. This is kind of a man cave since uh Bobby passed away. She would probably not like that. No, I don't think like... the kitchen <laughs> yeah, floor like she... that. She would hate it. So uh But I people see it. People see that axe, they think that's you, but that was actually Barbie's axe. That's Barbie's axe. Yeah, yeah that's a Johnston's winner. Yeah. From Canada. And she was definitely a winner. So I got some groceries all packed to go up north. When are we going? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> we should be. I know it. Uh, we can't go this weekend, but maybe the following week. Yeah, could be in second. Yeah. We got to get uh, Stevie to hook up the gas. No, we got to. Yeah, it's too bad we can't line up that electrician, too. We probably can. Yeah. We'll line up Stevie and the electrician at the same time and yeah. go up and have a bowl. Yeah. It's... And hopefully we can do the cabinets at the same time. Well, I don't think we... No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, we could take up two of them. Yeah. The two smaller ones that yeah. we're building. Uh, but the long one we'd have to take up in the trailer, I think, in the spring. Yeah. But I bought this the other day thinking, I don't have a good first aid kit. I was Jeez. thinking of keeping that in the, in the snowmobile. For, good idea. You know, all I keep, carry is a couple band-aids, but if anything more severe happens, yeah. uh, it's got a little more stuff in it. That's so, a pretty good idea. I got one in mine underneath the seat. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, well, let's go look at some of the progress. Now, this is... This garage is what you would call a working garage. <laughs> in other words, you can hardly get the vehicles in. So it's like most main, so much stuff. most main garages. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, so as you can see, it's quite Holy a disaster. Cow. You've been busy. Uh, got the old 46 Willys here. Kind of restored when I, when I purchased it. And I, I'm gonna, yeah, it's been, I've had it, this is the second year, and I'm gonna do something this summer and get it painted and, and go on. That would look awesome up to camp. Yeah. So this is the long base cabinet, and, uh, wow, that thing so is huge. It's, it's, yeah, well, it's 11 feet long. Wow. We measured. Holy cow. You said you wanted counter space. Wow. So you got counter space. I'd say so. But this will go against the wall. There'll be a kitchen sink in here somewhere. Mm -hmm. uh, and there's another cabinet that's going to be coming off here, like a five foot cabinet from here out five feet. And then the kitchen stove. And then a two-foot cabinet on the other side of the stove. Okay, so that's right in the corner then. Yeah, so yeah. this will be the corner. And then the couch is at the end of that? The couch is at the end. Okay, yeah. beautiful. Yeah, so I would just I would just cut in some pocket. Uh, I like to use pocket screws when I, when I connect things up. Oh, that's yeah. That's what you call a pocket screw. Okay. And I have some on the back side. And I have them on the back side of this, connecting these two together. So I'm going to have this is going to be in here, you know, yeah. standing up as a divider. Are you doing shelves in there? 
this part will be connected to the other. So, but oh, be, okay. But there will be shelves in the rest of it. Gotcha. But I could drill this other pocket. This is this is the little jig they provide, mm -hmm. and the drill. That does is make an angle angle cut and uh, these are the pocket screws so that would go in at an angle like that okay and this would be on here like this and that would connect it and I have plugs where these oh, pocket wow. screws are visible I can plug them so it looks pretty nice. This is pretty fancy. Well, I I don't like to use nails and then putty them. Yeah. Because it takes a different, if you stain it, usually the putty takes a different stain. Mm -hmm. You color than the wood. So I like to try to hide everything if I can. All right, let's go upstairs and see what what the other cabinets look like. Beautiful. I'm excited to see them. I've been away fishing all week. I know. So I haven't seen it. I keep an arm guard right at the bottom nice. of the stairs. <laughs> now the workshop looks about like the downstairs. Maybe a little worse. Beautiful. I, I put in that monitor heater this oh, yeah. last summer. Yeah. Which does a pretty decent job. And uh, this is the two foot cabinet. Nice. So it'll be a pull out draw here. On the bottom, I'm going to make a raised, not a raised panel door, but a flat panel door. Mm -hmm. and that goes next to the oven? That goes on, yeah, next to the oven. This one. Is coming off that main one. This will be on the oven. Would be over here, the stove. Okay. And this would tie into that one downstairs. So pull wow, out, looking good. Pull out drawers, shelves. I'll put some shelves in the big one too. Mm-hmm. Looking awesome. Nice, beautiful, really. Yeah. Where'd you get this wood? At Hunts and. Uh, I had to, you know, you have to pick it. <laughs> you have to pick it. Yeah. This was a stain. Oh, beautiful. Cured in pine. I was going to stain it. Yeah, that looks awesome. Uh, and then I'll urethane over it. Yeah. You think that's good enough? I like it. All right. That'll look awesome with the floor, I think. Yeah. So, so this is, yeah, this is my... Uh, place I like to go to. It's a total disaster. That's the way it should be. See, Where'd you get all these axes? <laughs> I didn't steal them from you. <laughs> <laughs> no, you uh, sure didn't. Uh, but, yeah, so this, as I say, is a mess. It takes me half an hour to find anything I want to find. <laughs> But I don't care. No, who cares? This is awesome. Wow, I can't believe how nice this is. That will fit in that tote sled. Yeah, this yeah. this this would. We can wrap it up with bubble wrap or Yeah, I got some old blankets so yeah. throw around. Geez, that'd be awesome. And uh, that one will fit obviously. Yeah. This was made out of one of our patterns for a 26 yeah, inch Emerson right. Stevens jersey at X handle. <laughs> <laughs> so we know where it came from. I, I save every scrap of wood. Yeah, that's awesome. Use it. I know we got that 200. Look at this. I, you'll never see this, but no. that's a yeah. piece of wood. I... Yeah, this, uh, this white ash over here, it was 200 years old in a barn and it was 200 years old growing. So that's 400, 400 to 450 right. years old. Yeah. And we got that saved up there. For axe handles, yeah. eventually. 
We have too many projects going on, Joey. I agree. I got, I'm working on the table and the bunk beds in my head anyway. Yeah. But those pocket screws are really, really handy. And they're good and strong? Oh my gosh. They draw things together. I mean, it's rugged as anything. Like a toenail, right? Yeah. 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 Except better. Yeah. So. Beautiful. So we're looking pretty good. Coming. We're coming. There's a beauty there. Yeah. I wonder who made that handle. I don't know. Somebody who knew what they were doing, I <laughs> guess. <laughs> uh, we've been here, Joey. Yeah. That's right where we went camping, right? No. no well, that's, that's Lone Pine. The campsite the before yeah. we get down to where we yeah. camp. Beautiful. Well, what do you think on these cabinets? I think they're coming pretty good. They look good to me. I'm yeah. stoked. Yeah. Oh, I, I want to show people this axe rack, too. That, that's the coolest axe rack. You built me one of these, too. Yeah. That thing is awesome for, for the good heads. Really cool way to display them. Yeah. yeah. They're looking good. I, I see. got to get you, make you some more of these posters. I know. Those are so the, cool. Yeah. I see you guys been cutting some wood while I was gone. Yeah. Yeah, Jamie's up there, selective cut, and I hit in that windstorm we had, we had the few blow over. And Looks like nice pine. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. What's so amazing about that up there, that was all field when I was a kid. No way. Where those pines are. I didn't know that. There might have, yeah, there might have been a few, you know, taller trees along the walls, stone wall. Yeah. But basically that was... You know, it might have been a few pines, you know, like three, four feet high. Wicked. Yeah, now look at it. Huh. But the weeds that, was, the woods. that was uh, 70 odd years ago. Yeah. A lot happens in 70 it years. It sure does. Cool. Well, so main public radio keeps me occupied up here when I'm working. I hear that. Oh, these look amazing, don't you? Yeah. Well, I'm going to try to stain these before we bring them up. Yeah. And uh, urethane them. So we can get these two in easy. Yeah. yeah. The 11-footer, we gotta, maybe we'll have to make a sled for it. We could. Or toboggan. We could uh, use your big sled and then another, put a, put a rope between yeah. the two sleds and then the other one. Yeah, yeah. And lash them. Somehow. Yeah, just like they do out west with the logs, the long logs. Right. Put like another trailer behind it. Yeah. Another sled behind it. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. It'd make a good video going in. I don't know. Either, either way, it's going to be fun. Yeah. I don't know. Is there that much snow up there now? I don't either. I got to make a few phone calls. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully they get enough for the dog sled races. Oh, I think by that time they will. So. Yeah. Well, so well, that's, that's the uh, extent of what I've gotten done. Nice. You want to tell anybody else about the cabin? Anything new or old? Or... Jeez, I can't think of anything. When were we up there last? Jeez, when we had Elliot. Yeah, that's right. That yeah. was, uh, so I haven't edited that. First part yet. of January. Yeah. But we're going to bring this yeah. up, right? What's that? We're bringing old, this up. Old grinder. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Hand, Hand grinder. grinder. Yeah, we'll have that up there. <laughs> we'll have all sorts of goodies up there. Uh, yeah. So we don't want to get it looking too nice. No, know? too then nice. Everybody yeah. will want to come. That's up right. Here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, this eleven footer is crazy nice. Will be. We to get it tied it off. I just started it yesterday. Oh, did you really? Yeah. Man, that's a lot of work. We've been lucky that quite a few or a couple of subscribers actually do this for a living. Yeah. And they've offered, but the trouble is they live, you know, 10, away. 15 states away. Yeah. So we're, we're yeah. wicked thankful that people offer and, and, uh, and stuff. Yeah. But the nice thing is Donnie's, geez, you've built a lot of cabinets, haven't you? Well, quite a few. Yeah, you built these ones, right? The yeah, cherry ones? The cherry ones in the house. Those are gorgeous. And, uh. Yeah, but, you know, I got 
nothing to do and this you know I work on it when I want to work on it yeah. and, you know I don't do it full time and you gotta tell the folks at home the story you told me about while I was gone Randy going out and talking to the ice fisher oh, yeah yeah he went off the beach here in town and and uh we don't have much ice we haven't the great bay froze those scum over and then the wind came along and took a lot of the ice out and pushed it up against the shores and and some of it was pushed up against the beach area and, and now it's refrozen and uh, last i guess it was last sunday he went down there were two vehicles down i guess down at the beach and they were out there ice fishing and uh one of them was in where the ice had blown in so it was a little thicker yeah one went out a little too far Got one trap in with about, Randy said, about an inch of ice. Jeez. And uh, when the end of the day came, he, he he got a little nervous and didn't dare go get his trap, I guess, and just left it there. <laughs> I've never heard of that before. <laughs> <laughs> I would have been a little nervous putting one in. Yeah, that's so funny. He had time to think about it. Right, he had time to think about it. And, yeah. And he, uh, you know... <laughs> he lucked out getting it in, but he didn't know if he'd luck out getting it yeah, out. Yeah, <laughs> he didn't want to push his luck. I'll fly the drone over this afternoon and see if it's still yeah, there. Yeah, see if it's still there. I got to tell you a story, though. So yeah. this, so Don calls me yesterday, and he says he was in the diner down there. He's down in Connecticut again oh, yes, with yeah. his, all his friends. There's a group that eat breakfast every morning. Yeah. And he said one of his buddies comes in, older guy, and he's right down in the dumps. And Don says, hey, what, what's the matter with you? And the guy says, he says, I, he says, you won't believe it. He goes, my wife just left me for my best friend about a half hour ago. And Don and all the other guys are like, geez, that's awful. Geez, that's terrible and all this stuff. And Don says, you know, how, how long has he been your best friend? He goes, about a half hour. <laughs> <laughs> I got a kick out of that one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I probably won't do a heck of a lot more today, but, no. you know, I'll probably just sit in the chair and finish reading the Lincoln County. It's Hill. not a bad idea. But, uh, no, I'm going to go uh, check some ice conditions over across town. I want to see if Dyer's got any ice at all. Yeah. 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 And, uh, yeah. Clary, I... I don't know. They fishing on clearing. I, I it was froze over last night when I came through, but it had snow on it. So yeah, it's yeah. frozen twice or three times. Got snow on it. I you, know it. You can't see. And... No. I mean, just looking at the lake right now, look at all the pockets of water sitting on top of that. Yeah. But I think that's you know probably yeah. It doesn't look like it's even frozen. No. I wouldn't trust it today, but after, it's supposed to be negative three, I think, in a couple days. Yeah, yeah, first of the week, Monday and Tuesday, it's supposed to be wicked cold. Yeah. So, yep. but it's going to take more than a couple couple nights of freeze. That's true. To get it safe. Yeah, that is true. Got to be safe, better safe than sorry. Yeah. Well, guys, thanks for uh, tuning in. This was just a quick update, Donnie's. Uh, showing this, I figured you guys we get a lot of questions about the cabinets, so figured I'd show you this. And that, so I did, they got that that moose in 2013, the only permit I ever. I know drawn. you put in forever, didn't you? I just put in from since they started, and I think they started in '81 or '82. I put in every year since and got drawn once. They felt sorry for me and let me have a permit. 719 pounds it says uh, that one i you know i was just we were just riding around yeah checking different roads found that one that's a corker that's a nice one that would have been a nice one yep yeah. so but oh. we'll enjoy the camp and hopefully there'll be some moose hunts out of that oh i and promise we'll, you there will be yeah yeah, next year. Maybe even a little trapping next year. Yeah. Oh, I want to do trapping. Yeah. Oh, my gosh, yeah. Got to do that. Yeah.
All right. Well, guys, thanks for tuning in. We really appreciate it. Donnie appreciates the shift. You got any questions well, on the cabinets? Sawzall. Take that yeah, I'll yeah. grab that. If you guys have any questions or, or anything, leave them in the comments. Donnie reads them all. I read them all. So we appreciate all the support and yeah. all the kind words and all the positivity on the yeah. channel. Yeah. Yeah, we, we uh, all the suggestions you have, you know, it's great to, great to have different ideas on di doing different things and and uh, so, yeah, so stay tuned, I guess, and we'll try to have an update and continue this little program. That's right. Thanks, Donnie. Yeah. All right.